Hey, little fella. You hungry? Huh? Ah, damn it. Hey, hey, hey. It's okay. That's it. Come on. <laughs> Cutie. <laughs> cool. Hello? Wow, graffiti all the way up here? Chris? Are you here? Huh. Hey then.
Ah, oh, Emily. bag are you hello what do we have here So, I found something kind of amazing. What? I'm not going to tell you. You got to see for yourself. Come on, it's this way. W where? Right around here. Going to blow your mind. Ta-da! Pretty rad, right? Yeah. Come on, look at these beauties. Uh, beauties is not the word that comes to mind. Why is this even here? What do you mean? W what the hell is a shooting range doing at the base of a ski lodge? Uh, dude, have you ever met Josh's dad? Yeah. He thinks he's like Grizzly Adams or something. Wanna try? Uh, no, you go ahead, Grizzly. All right, here goes. Yes, it was a wild case of beginner's luck. No, nah, I don't think so, girl. Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. Oh, come on. Squirrels are just rats with bushy tails. I cannot believe you just did that. Ah! Holy crap! Oh, my God, put it back! Get it away! Ah! <sighs> Jesus, are, are you okay? This mountain is freaking me out already. Hey, hey, look. Our, our cable car is coming. Let's grab our ride. Coming back up. Hey, that's weird. Door's locked. Yeah. Uh, Josh wanted us to keep it locked to keep people out. He said that? What people? I, I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. Oh, real gentlemen.
And I thought the car was closer. Guess we gotta wait. I'm starting to get the appeal of killing time at the shooting range. How long is this gonna take? It's a big mountain. Yeah. It's so beautiful in the day, but at night just feels menacing, like a sleeping giant. You gonna publish? What? Your pretty poem. The Sleeping Giant of Blackwood Forest. Oh, wow. What a crazy place to set up house. No matter how rich you are. Finally, you coming? Yeah, well, I was gonna stay here and catch some Z's, but okay. Mm, just like going to the prom. Here we go. Right, adventure begins. You know, getting everyone together on the anniversary. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell with him, right? And I've kind of been worried. No, no, it was, it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro. Good talk. You know what? Let's just let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. Ah, uh, you know what? You're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Okay. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room. I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so. So I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. Match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early, and on that day decided to wear a low-cut shirt that showed off her train bra, I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. Right now. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. really weird stroke we're stuck in this stupid thing can you please let us out pretty please oh my god i thought we were goners another 10 minutes in there and i would have chewed off my own leg oh sick chris look you got a lot of meat on my bones it's all muscle down here yeah right uh-huh <laughs> Hey! <laughs> well, 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 what do we have Chris. here? My goodness! Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president, Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. Give that back, you tool. Tool and die. That's my motto. Oh, you're such an idiot. Maybe nosy Nancy shouldn't go nosing around in other people's nostrils. Uh, yeah, I, I try not to do that as a rule. Come on, Jess, you can tell us. You can totally keep secrets. Whatever. 
You'll figure it out eventually. All right, all right. Let's just get up to the lodge already. It's getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? Uh, I mean, you know, whoever. Uh-huh. Sam? <sighs> Did you see this view? I mean, holy cow. Sometimes I forget to just stop and take it all in. Seriously, couldn't they have built the lodge, like, right where the evil car ends? I don't think it would have been, like, as pretty, you know? And where's the bellboy when you need one? <sighs> getting chills. We're almost there. No, I mean, getting kind of creeped out. Oh, yeah. It's gonna be weird seeing everyone up here again. Definitely not gonna feel like a regular party. I mean, what do you think? Ah! Oh, Jesus! <laughs> you guys. Michael! You really, really should have seen your faces right there. Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> nice one. Michael, you're a jerk. Come on. Guys, we're all friends here, right? No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. We're up in the woods, it's spooky. Come on, let's get into the spirit of things. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? I'm just trying to lighten the mood, Em. Don't be like that. Like what? The way you're being, you always get like this. Michael. I'm just gonna lay it out, otherwise this whole weekend's gonna suck ass for everyone. Um, this is super awkward, and we all know it. Let's just, uh, acknowledge it now and move on, okay? Matt. I hear you, man. I get it. I don't want to make this weird. Cool. So we're good? All good. You guys gonna make out now? Oh, my God, totally. We're so gonna make out. Uh, no. Seriously, I'm gonna go check on the cable car back down the trail. All right. See you, man. See ya. All right. See ya. Crap. What? Hey, could you take these the rest of the way? The bags? Yeah, just all the bags. Uh, why? I need to go find Sam. Okay. Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. This really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important, Matt, please. Fine. If it's so important, I guess I can pack horse it the rest of the way. But you owe me one. Excuse me? Well, the more even, at least. I'll think about it. Just be careful. See you up there, sweetie. Thank you. Hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. And not in the friend zone kind of way. They might need to check the expiration date on their big breakup. <laughs> oh! Oh, <God>. hey. <laughs> hey, whoa. Hey, sorry there. Sorry about that, Ash. I didn't mean to scare Just you. Louise, well, Matt. I did mean to scare you, sort of scare you, but not like for real oh scare you. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Hey, wow. Man, I'm, I'm really sorry, Ash, damn. It's okay, it's fine, it's fine. What are you looking at? See anything juicy with that thing? Uh, it... Let me check it out. No. Yeah, it's...
kind of busted. It's not, it's not like really interesting. It's just. What? <laughs> For real? I, I bet I could find like a cool bear chowing down on a fox or something. No, really, Matt, it's not worth straining your eyes. I'm getting kind of a headache just from looking through it, so just no, no. All right. Uh, sure, if you say so. I'll just do that. Put your hands where I can see them. We've got you, Saran. But who am I to retaliate? What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? I, well, I don't know when you put it like that. Hey! <laughs> go down? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> I think you'd know so if I did. <laughs> all right, all right. My, my. So are we calling it my favor, then? You're a worthy opponent, Miss Jessica the Snowball Queen. OK, that sounds vaguely dirty. My lady. Ah! Oh, OK. Okay, you're really gonna get it. What am I gonna get? Well, I can think of at least one thing. Yeah? But you'll have to wait until later. We should get up to the lodge. Yeah. It's so nice out here, though. Pretty breathtaking. I mean, I could stay out here pretty much ever, provided I was making out with you the whole time. Just making out? Quote, unquote. Well. I think we might freeze to death somewhere in between those quotes. Yeah. Hello again. How are we feeling? Hmm? It seems we hardly scratched the surface in our last session, so let's go a little bit deeper this time. This time, we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Now pick up that book, turn the pages, you will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious.
Did I startle you? So sorry. You're doing very well. Don't be nervous. Try to speed up a bit. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightening you will find this experience. This is very interesting. Thank you for answering so diligently. <laughs> Spiders, scarecrows, and crows. The sun combination sounds like a good Friday night. <laughs> uh, well, I'm afraid once again we're out of time, but. I promise we'll talk again very soon. <laughs>